What's up, BTB? All right, day seven, the 12 days of trumpet. All right, day seven is going to be brief, but I do want to bring something up because I pretty much wasted the entire day sitting around doing nothing except being scatterbrained. I got some decent practice in the, the first part of the day, I played for maybe like an hour or so, and uh, I had the entire day free, by the way. So what did I do? I sat on the couch and went down a rabbit hole of YouTube and started watching a bunch of videos, which at first was really cool and I was really digging some stuff. You know, I was checking out some great players. But then after a while, I started watching these videos of Wynton Marsalis <laughs> burning over Cherokee, right? One after the other, after the other, and I get all jazzed. So I grab my trumpet and what do I do? I try to do what he's doing. I just basically play a bunch of really fast shit, but he's really good at it and I'm not there. Yet, I'm not there. I just keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. And then all of a sudden my chops start feeling weird. My sound doesn't sound right. Huh, maybe if I use a different mouthpiece, even though I only ever use one mouthpiece, maybe I'll put a 3C in and all of a sudden I'll play like Winton. Boom, put the 3C in. Just getting worse and worse and worse, okay? I start thinking about mouthpieces. Huh, well maybe if I get this kind of a mouthpiece and do this, that, and the other. No, game over. I gotta put my trumpet in the case, put it in the closet. I did my best to forget about it. Went to the gym, sat in the sauna, tried to apply the skill of chill, which I need a hefty dose of these days, folks, because I have not been staying true to my skill of chill, and it is starting to show. The whole point here is, when you're playing your horn, when you're practicing your instrument, you need to stay true to what you are capable of, and you need to work where you are. Anytime you try to work where you're not, you're not gonna get a lot of good out of that. We really need to approach it with this calm, systematic, so almost carefree in a way, mindset, where we're just doing what we can do. Great, that's good enough. And we keep doing that every day, and lo and behold, one of these days we get somewhere, hopefully. But we're definitely not gonna get anywhere or anywhere we wanna be by trying to do things that are just too far outside of our technical limits or our uh, musical experience because we're just gonna end up burning out our chops. Whatever you can do, Whenever you can do it, that's what you do. So stay true to the moment, what you are right now. Find your center, find your balance. Stay there, work there. And if you find that you start to get a little bit frantic or ahead of yourself, it's time to take a break, set the horn down, practice the skill of chill. When we pick up our instruments, we want to enter a good, calm, relaxed, open, receptive space, state for learning and just wiggling our fingers and trying to play a bunch of bullshit is not gonna do that. So, I will talk to you later.